Hi, in this video, I would like to show you how to mount this a uh, MS uh, 492 uh, LED D driver on the back of the screen. But you know, you, you can mount it like this, you're just using a uh, peel off this tape like this. But this is not what we recommend because when you mount it like this, you're gonna twist this um, ribbing cable. Of course, you can force in on the back of the cover, but it might damage it. But that's not right. Um, the best way would be just put it on the back of the the cover so if this is the front this is uh you know screen mount on the back just just stick it in um if you want to peel off this tape and stick it that's okay and as i said uh, you know previously we have shown you a video how to put the led lights on this chopper one inch uh this is actually for a uh, x61 uh, lenovo chopper one inch so the way to mount see now it's everything's in place and ribbon cable uh we have connected this red green and black wire to the inverters so we can you we then we can keep all this LED indicators. So here's the back cover. Here's what I want to show you. Back cover, flick over, stick it in. Alright. That's it. This is why you can fix it. That's, that's it. Okay, you don't have to peel out that uh, the double side tape and uh, let me show you how it was laid out if you can see it. You see this? You see this? Just stick it inside and um, you don't have to tape it and make sure make sure this wire comes out this is the wire, make sure this wire comes out correctly and uh, just put the inverter back place, back to the place and uh, put the wire back to the place and you can feel it if you want to put it back this cover alright See, that's it. So you put the screw back. You put a screw back. Um, that would be it. You know, it's uh, you just the all indicate light still on the inverter. So basically, is that. So don't worry about the inverter because you don't have to remove the transfer from the inverter as long as there's no backlight connected to the inverter. The inverter will not have high voltage output. It will shut down by itself. And of course, the indicate light. Even though inverter shut off, the indicate light still will indicate what it's supposed to be. Okay, thank you for watching.